Congratulations, Mr. President. One year before Barack Obama's historic inauguration, Charles Tyson was making some history of his own. He was quietly sworn in as the first African-American mayor of tiny South Harrison, New Jersey, a big moment in a very white small town. And my family was beside me and we all hugged and said it was a, it was a great moment. How long did those good feelings last? Uh, not that long. Before Tyson could do anything in office, he was hit with something he never knew existed here, hate. A defaced campaign sign appeared in front of his home with an unmistakable message. Uh, they painted in red, uh, KKK, and on the other side, they uh, painted nigger. South Harrison rallied around its mayor. They put up a $20,000 reward for the person who planted the sign. But no one came forward, and then things got worse. Bill White, one of the country's most notorious white supremacists, whose website once displayed a picture of Barack Obama in the crosshairs, allegedly contacted Tyson. He knew where you lived, he knew right. your wife's name, right. he knew your phone number, right. and your internet address. Absolutely. He knew everything about you. Yes, he did. A federal indictment says White called Tyson's wife and emailed him, calling him unworthy to govern over any white man and hoping to see the day when white men could run black officials out with tar and feathers. There are many people who have been badly frightened uh, by Bill White, uh, and the New Jersey mayor is not the only one of them. White is also accused of posting the address of a federal juror, allegedly attempting to encourage someone to do the juror harm. White's now in federal custody, and his lawyer defends his words to Charles Tyson and others with the First Amendment. There is no threat in the communication that he sends to the mayor. They're trying to pick and choose Mr. White's words to make it look like a threat. But White's words did have an effect on Tyson. Fearing for himself and his family, Tyson quit as mayor to take a lower profile town council position. And he's now worried about another history maker. Are you concerned about what might happen to Barack Obama? Very much so. Very because much of so. your experience? Very much. Racism was here yesterday, it's here today, and it's going to be here tomorrow. Tyson plans to testify in the federal case against White, but says he no longer has the ambition for higher office. David Mattingly, CNN South Harrison, New Jersey.